so the question arises is why date why not something else of course it's uh, ramazan but why not something else for ramazan so dates has been my companion for past a year or so i had super sugar craving and uh, simultaneously i was asked not to consume that much sugar it would be harmful and my hb was also very down so i had to have i had to eat dates and how funny i just realized i picked up those three dates out of habit so i thought why not let's let's paint dates i know the texture so well i have been observing it for quite a long time now so basically what i'm doing is i am using those shades as shown in my last video and trying to bring in blend it in and marking patches as usual as i said i cannot show that much of detail in this uh, painting because the size of the canvas is very small if it would have been on a bigger canvas of course more detail but uh, this is easy for me for still life i usually prefer quickly dividing the composition into darks and lights and mid tones that we already created in our last video i am using a very thin brush for this and moving my hands in patchy manner because dates have that texture it's uh, quite irregular a few bumps are very prominent so i'm bringing some highlights and shadows around it and uh, so right now today i'm just going to blend it in and leave a painting for a day because i'm observing if i am working more on it um the paint is lifting up so i'm just going to leave it for a while so i'm adding a bit of white highlights uh, the prominent ones is because white paint dries very uh, with uh, very slowly it takes a lot of time for it to dry and i and i don't want it to be blended uh, i want some part of it to be uh, quite prominent so i'm just going to put some whites and wait for it to dry and continue with the next day i'm just going to fill in for the shadows again i'm doing those things that i really wanted to dry and i will work on it next day so yeah i am again now i'm adding uh, i'm moving my hands very slowly adding extreme darks and lights uh, the painting that i did yesterday is dried now so i am also making those highlights bit lighter and moving in tones and shades on it and moving extreme darks so that the freshness of the color comes out so basically when you leave a painting uh, for a day for it to dry and then come back the next day it increases the layers and first the painting was a bit translucent now it becomes opaque the canvas is shown less less if the paint is becoming thicker um if until and unless you want that water um 
water color effect then i would say leave the painting as it is and uh, don't bring in that much sharp details because in water colors there are no sharp details in oil painting there are so it depends on what kind what kind of texture you want to bring in so if you don't want to bring in those texture you can just leave it as it is so here i'm adding a bit of more prominent whites blending it in and so here is the work the final look thank you everyone for watching my videos